Welcome everybody to another bonus episode here on the Wrestle Dude YouTube channel, and it is another gummy food video. And this time we're going back to E Fruity, with this time being the E Fruity Gummy Verse. And I'm very interested uh, to see the differences between this one and the previous one. If you guys didn't see the previous one, I'll link it at the end of this video in like the end card screen, so you guys can watch that one. But yeah, this one seems to be pretty interesting. Uh, I was at Party City grabbing some stuff for Halloween. Uh, I'm filming this around the time of like October, the end of September, stuff like that. So I was getting some stuff for Halloween and I found this and along with a couple other gummy things that I've already eaten. And then I figured why not just make another uh, bonus video about this one. So this is the gummy verse packaging. Uh, so by the way, if you guys are ever at Party City, um, Pick up one of these if you see it's pretty good I think this one was like $3.99 compared to the last one that I got which I bought for like $1.99 although this does seem to have more stuff in it than the other one so it, it may be a better price okay try not to spill everything here but it's kind of hard getting the packaging open okay so let's see here oh pff, I kind of damaged the packaging uh, opening it up so let's see, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven things to try here. And they're not really labeled at all, except for maybe like this uh, alien head, who knows. Uh, well, it's a good thing that I'm eating this around the time for, uh, <laughs> what is it? I I'm pretty sure it would have passed after now, the whole like storm area 51 thing. Uh, but uh, let's see here, we got like, gummy uh what is that jupiter it's the or saturn the one with the rings around it I, I don't know planets that well i thought they were ufos at first they may be ufos either ufos or uh little planets then we've got let's see here gummy rocket ship uh that does not look like anything else it is just a rocket ship uh we've got a gummy astronaut check that out that's pretty cool looks pretty tasty uh, like I mentioned earlier, we have a gummy alien face. Uh, what is this? Uh, that, I believe, is supposed to be gummy earth, although it looks to be more flat. Uh, we need to fix that. <laughs> Let me know in the comment section below. Are you a flat earther? And then... I don't know what they... These just look like really tiny, like, sour gummy worms. I don't know what these are supposed to be for... Yeah, they kind of just, even the packaging, like, look right here. There's, like, gummy sour worms in, like, a space capsule. I don't know if that's supposed to be a reference to, like, astronauts taking worms into outer space or something like that. I don't know. I mean, cool. Seems fun. Okay, so I've got the planets. One is red, one is yellow. Um, I don't know which one I want to try first. I'll try red. I'm expecting it to be, like... It kind of smells like watermelon. Mm. Oh. It kind of just tastes like a fruit snack. You know? It's kind of just kind of bland flavor. I don't know. Maybe this yellow one will be different. It kind of has the same smell. It smells like watermelon. And then you actually eat it, and then... It doesn't really taste like anything. Mmm. Yeah, pretty good. I like fruit snacks, so that's pretty good. Was expecting more of a taste, though. Okay, let's do this little rocket ship. Okay, rocket ship uh, is out of the packaging. Here we go. <coughs> the candy's not bad. I just <coughs> got something caught in my throat. Mmm. This is like really chewy. Mm. You know, it doesn't really taste like anything. It's the same thing with the planets. There's not really any taste to it. Hmm. Well, that's gonna let down. I hope the rest of this isn't really like that. Okay, let's let's try the little astronaut dude. So I got the little astronaut guy out. I will say, I do like the designs on this. They got really, really close with the detail, as close as they possibly could with like the astronaut stuff. Uh, on the front, I mean on the back, it's just plain, but I mean, 
it's kind of the front that you're more worried about. It's not like someone's going to complain like, I can't see the astronaut ass. How am I supposed to know it's an astronaut? Shut up. It's an astronaut. Just look at the front. Uh, looks pretty cool here. I feel like the more detail they could have added is maybe like where the helmet is on the glass part. They could have made it like a baby blue color, kind of like with this like blue that they used for the planet Earth, um, the incorrect planet Earth. Uh, <laughs> but let's test this out here. I'm gonna I'm gonna bite off the head. Mm. There we go. I want to actually taste it a little bit better. Still kind of has that fruit snack taste to it, but for some reason it just tastes a little bit better. Well, at least you won't have to worry about suffocating in space. Okay, um, next, uh, I think I might have said we were going to do this last, but we're going to do it now. Uh, it's the little alien, gummy alien face. Very good detail. It's got like eye sockets here that you can actually stick your finger in, so it's got some depth to it. And then, for some reason, it seems like they covered up the mouth with something. I don't know if that's supposed to be aesthetic-wise. Um, I feel like some of these are just kind of like errors when they were making the candy and they just left it in. Um, and then, yeah, it's like double-layered. There's like a green layer and then there's like a lighter layer on the back where you can see like where the eye holes are. So, this will be interesting. I really hope this isn't another, like, fruit snack taste. Nope, can't even bite into it. Jesus Christ. Apparently aliens have harder heads to bite than ours. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I bit that guy's head off. <laughs> mm. That was really hard to pull. Mm. Alright. No, I don't like that. I don't like that. Ew. I'm not even e eating the rest of that. Like, I don't know what the hell that... I don't know what that taste was. It was just so rough to bite into. It just did not taste good. Okay, we're gonna move on to the inaccurate earth. Um, let's see here. I do like they also added in a lot of detail for this inaccurate earth. I don't know if you guys can see that here. I'm gonna try and, like, maybe get some light on it there. You can see all the continents. So you can see Africa, Asia... North and South America, Canada, stuff like that. I think Australia's over there, yeah. I don't know, there might be Hawaii. Let me see here. No Hawaii. Apparently, aliens think that Hawaii doesn't really exist. So, uh, aliens, you got a problem with that, then I must redirect you to the movie Battleship, where I believe some aliens get killed on the Hawaiian Islands. Uh, but, yeah, it's also double-layered. I'm really worried that this is going to have the same taste as that alien head. Uh, hopefully I can bite into the earth easier than uh, I can bite into an alien head. Um, I guess I'll just bite North America first. Hmm, okay. So that was kind of easier to bite into. Mm. It's very fluffy. Mm. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll finish this. I like that. That was really good. Yeah, that one, that one tasted better than the alien head, definitely. Hmm. Alright, and then finally, the last thing that we have in the tray that I'm actually going to eat are... Oop, one fell out. These little uh, space worms, apparently. I mean, I can probably guess what these are going to taste like, but I'll hold it up for suspense. I wonder what that tastes like! Hey. Mm. These don't even taste sour. Maybe I gotta eat a lot. I'm gonna take like a handful of worms. I'm like the boogeyman. Mm. 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 Okay, now I can kind of taste sour. Yeah. They just look like really tiny versions of the trolley sour worms. That's it. I mean, they taste good. These are the best thing in the freaking thing. And that's just because it didn't have a freaking fruit snack taste to it like everything else did. Uh, if I had to rank everything like I did with the last one, I would put the alien head and the alien head at the bottom, and then put pretty much everything else, like the spaceship, the astronaut, the planets, stuff like that, put that stuff in the middle, and then put the little gummy worms at the top, because 
gummy worms are fucking awesome. So, if, if you guys wanted to know my rankings for it, there you go. Alien head on the bottom, everything else in the middle, and then gummy worms up top. So, all in all, I don't think this was a better, like, I liked the older one better. I liked the first one that I did better. It had a whole lot more variety to it. At least some of it had, like, a lot better taste. All of this just kind of tasted like they used the same stuff and just changed the color. Like, I, I don't know. Uh, Gummyverse is definitely not a universe I want to go back to. But, you know, if fruit snack tastes are your thing, then definitely pick one up at Party City. You know, this isn't really an ad or anything. It was just a bonus video. But uh, I had some fun. This stuff tasted pretty okay, except for that alien head. Um, now, if you'll excuse me, I got a couple more space worms to eat here. And they are going into my mouth. See you guys next time. Yep. Thanks for watching. Click on your screen now to see more.